It's the Kuliana Negroni, not to be confused with the Rocks Jabroni, but it's the rum version, cocktail version of Kuliana Negroni. <laughs> okay. Just Drinking's back with Kuliana Hawaiian Rum Agricole. Yeah, baby. Ooh, we've got an agricole. We don't haven't done a ton of those up to this no, point. We like we've got a few of them out there. Yep. We kind of share there's a big difference between a lot of agricole and now we've got a Hawaiian agricole that we get to share with everyone. So this is US technically, but it's still an island off. It's it the is. US island. The only other island besides Iowa. You know, we <laughs> yeah. Iowa is such a big island. It's, a, it's, a, it's in the middle of the country, but we do have an island yeah, here. We're, in we're Iowa. kind of, you know, on our own type thing. <laughs> Anywho, are you talking about Island Park over here? No, I'm not talking about <laughs> Island Park. There's a real island here. Google it. Another video. <laughs> Anywho, this is exciting because we have been going through a series of Kuliana rums. It's the third one in our series yes. that we're checking yes, out. Uh, a great company so far. We've had tremendous luck so far. Yeah, this yeah. is the easiest rum delicious. that they have to pronounce. For, to pronounce, yes. Which is exciting. I was excited to yell Hawaiian rum agricole and not have to pronounce something crazy uh so that was awesome but this is a 40 percent 80 proof fresh sugarcane juice rum now the one thing that's really nice about this company is they don't do any extra added colors or sugars or any of that kind of just stuff. just like royer you get what you see you get what you get if you guys are new to the show, I'm Robert. I'm Roy Ayer. And this is Just Drinking, where we drink rum and tell you about it. Make sure if you love drinking rum, finding new rums, or hanging out with other rum lovers, Join that us. you guys hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, make sure to comment that you're here. We love hearing from you guys, and we want to make sure you guys are checking out the links down below of our rum club, where we're sending rum to your doorstep, drinking with distillers, as well as our Facebook group, our Instagram. We've got all kinds of crazy stuff. Come have stuff a drink going. with us. We have tons Hang of out. fun. It's a blast. Yes, we have a ton of fun, so welcome to the show. All right, so this one is 100% fresh pressed sugarcane juice, right? Distilled yep. at 60% to 74% ABV. Uh, no age aging process in this. This has notes of green bananas, F Fuji apples, Fuji, Ooh, Fuji cherries, apples. Japanese plum, and the everlasting gobstopper. Wow. Right? How about that? And they have a ton of info on their bottles so you can learn about their company in, in other ways. And I'm sure we're going to be meeting with them here soon. But this is great. Less than 5% of rum is made as an agricole. Rum made from fresh sugar cane juice. Less than 5%. Yeah. So this is hitting a market of rum that is really up and coming here in the United States. And we're really excited to try out what something they got going on. Something different. Something unique, right? I want to break this thing open. Let's break it. Well, don't break okay, it open. I, well, Just okay, open poor it. Poor choice of words. Yeah. Excuse I mean, me. it, there's going to be glass. Yeah. No. It's going to be dangerous. Yes. It's a clear rum with clear glass. It's not going to be good. Kuliana. Every bottle does that. I know. It's amazing. It's amazing. It is amazing. Oh. So this immediately comes out crystal clear. There's absolutely no coloring to this whatsoever. Right away, I definitely get those agricole hints. Yes. If you're not used to an agricole rum, this comes off as a very strong agricole. Has a little bit of that dunder kind of uh, funky smell coming off the top. I definitely pick up the green banana. Yeah. And the apples. I get a lot of fruity notes. I even sense the cherry in there that they're talking about yep. too. So I mean, I think that has I mean, a ton you, you, the of fruity aroma, notes going on. The aroma definitely says a lot right there. It's that there. funky fruit, right? If you're not familiar with funk, you're going to learn lots. If you're not familiar with agricoles, educate yourself yeah. because this is definitely hitting that exact spot of where rum is really kind of its roots of rum and where it came from and what it actually is, this, um, which is tremendous. This is absolutely crystal clear. Usually this kind of rum makes the best cocktails too. So I'm excited to sip it and just kind of get a sense for what the, right. what the flavors are. Wow, there's a lot of flavor there. There's a lot on. of flavor. A lot of flavor going I on. I agree there. with you. <laughs> wow. <laughs> now, what I like about this right off the bat is that it's not as in your face as some of the agricoles can get, right? Oh, this, yeah. It's dry smooth. It um, is dry. It's not it a is ton very of... very smooth. The, the, the boldness here is more in the flavor, not so much the heat of it. So right. the heat of the rum is pretty mild. It's more of a dry, smooth, easy rum to drink. That flavor is very bold because it has a lot of those fruity notes. So, I mean, you're getting that cherry, green banana um, kind of sense to it, but it's in a dry yep. agricole, kind of that earthy tone kind of a way. Um, and so you just got to kind of take that, if you're not uh, used to that kind of thing, understand what you're getting. And also, I really, really love the way that the fruit notes just like intertwine so smoothly. And it's just like settles right on your tongue. Yes, I love yes. that. Definitely the green bananas, the apples, a little bit of the cherry. There's just a lot of flavor going on. It's very dry, but it is extremely smooth. Yeah, I agree. You know, we've had a few rum agricoles, but this one is by far probably, you know, one of the top five smoothest. It's pretty smooth. I'll give it some really smooth you know, ability. But it's got a lot of really good flavor to it, I think. Yeah. I, I like those notes. I agree. This would make absolutely a wonderful cocktail. And if you have a chance, go to their website. What is their website again? Well, it's coolianarum.com. I mean, normally we do the rum and coke, but... We're not putting it into a Diet Coke and Diet Pepsi? Nope, nope. Oh, nope, that's so not. sacrilegious on the show. I know. We're that's... just going the whole month without mixing this diet. Well, you can sit right yeah, over we'll, here. We'll just set those aside. And all of the experience. So I did a little bit of re research. Excited about this. I did a little research, and I went to their website and checked out coolianarum.com. And you found a cocktail. I found a cocktail. Oh, my goodness. What specialty cocktail are we making tonight, Royer? This is it right here. I'm going to let you pronounce 
It's the Kuliana Negroni, not to be confused with the Rock's Jabroni, but it's the rum version, cocktail version of Kuliana Negroni. <laughs> okay. All right, Royer, let's hit an ingredient list. Ingredient number one is going to be the rum. The, the Kuliana rum. rum. Kuliana rum. rum. Hawaiian rum agricole. Right. You're lucky I'm here to correct you. Thank you. Ingredient number two is going to be the sweet vermouth. Ooh. Ingredient number three is going to be the Campari. And lastly, ingredient number four. Aperol. Now, I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing all these correctly. Oh, I'm sure you are. It's just an Iowa accent, guys. Get, <laughs> you got to get with the program so, here. From Iowa, we just say don't things. Don't criticize how the we, accent. How we decide to okay. say them is just how it works. So we're going to make a double batch. This is going to be uh, one and a quarter ounces, but we're going to put two and a half ounces in two here. Two and a half. Yes. This is an ounce or three quarters of an ounce of sweet vermouth. But right. we're going to put one and a half ounces for in Two there. people, one and a half. People. Three quarter normally, one and a half for this. Exactly. Campari is half an ounce. Half an ounce. But we're going to put one One ounce. whole ounce in. Yes. Look at us, adventuring. Do math, doing math. Math, math and mix. We're you know, basically I always, chemists. Okay, now here's the thing. I always wondered, when is the math actually going to pay off? When, you remember going to school, you're like, what, when, when am, am I going to use When math? am I going to really use All the teachers that were like, you're not going to have a calculator in your pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Little did I know. We would be doing, be using math right here at the bar. I know, I have to use right? my calculator, but you learned old, old school, so you don't even need a calculator. <laughs> That's right. So the last one is going to be half an ounce of Aperol, but we're putting one ounce in. One ounce in for the double batch. Awesome. Okay. Now, as, as the famous Royer does in his oh, yeah. cocktails, shake, 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 shake your body. Boom shakalaka. Pour this over. Awesome, over little, some clear ice. We got the clear, clear ice, ice in here tonight, ooh. Right? Ooh, look how clear. It's a lot clearer than I thought. I thought it was going to be a lot more colored. I mean, it is really colored. Like, don't get me wrong. It's like red. So, I mean, I guess that's really <laughs> colored. I, but it's just more see through y than I expected. I, I actually thought the vermouth and uh, the Campari would make it a bit thicker, but I love how the rum really thins it out and it makes it very elegant looking, very nice. Looks very tropical y. I hope I did. I hope I did this job. I hope you did too. You know, what's really crazy about this is this really makes it into a grapefruity drink, which yep. is weird because I don't think grapefruit was one of their like flavors, but I feel like with the alcohol, the way that it's mixed uh, with all of these items here, kind of brings out a much more natural grapefruity flavor uh, that I think is still dry, still smooth, smoother than it was even because it's mixed, yep. um, goes down very easy. And I think it brings out a lot more of the natural flavors too. So you get much too. more of a natural rum experience yep. with this as well, which is what agriculture is supposed to do. Absolutely. And it's, it's yummy. It's delicious. It, it, it is a very great yummy. job. Um, so the one thing that I did not do, they say that you're supposed to garnish this with a slice of grapefruit. No kidding. Is no Are you kidding. really? Oh. So, isn't that crazy? Oh. I'm so smart. <laughs> I'm so smart. It tastes like there's, it's grapefruit. So I get why you would garnish it with grapefruit. Absolutely. You squeeze a little bit of that grapefruit yep. in there. You get even more of that flavor in there. Tremendous. What a great job. I love the way that these come together and it makes it grapefruity. I think that's, if you like grapefruit and that kind of a thing, that natural grapefruit, yeah. it is just like that. It is. I, I feel healthy just drinking. I, I'm getting fitter. <laughs> this is now a fitness channel. <laughs> yeah, fantastic natural cocktail. I got to ask you, Royer, as I always do, sipping on this. We tried yep. it on its own. We've had it in a cocktail. What do you pay for this rum if I'm going out and trying to find myself a bottle? Well, here's the thing. I mean, you know, it's coming all the way from Hawaii. What do you think that you're going to pay for this bottle? I think that you will pay. I mean, I, gosh, I can't remember the last one. Dang it. I feel like it's similar to the last one. Is it do 60 you? bucks? 55. I, I don't know. 50, I'm $55. I'm locking you, it in, you, Royer. That's your final, final answer? Final answer, $55. You don't want to call a friend or no, anything? No, I don't. <laughs> uh, $65. $65. Dang yep. it, I went low. I yep. should have gone higher. $60 was what I was originally yep. thinking. You, you were really close. So I was really about. close, but you made me second guess. Yeah, I know. It. I love and doing that. I was that. like, oh, I, love no, doing I, feel that. Like, I feel like I'm going too high. <laughs> $65, I think. You should have gone with your first instinct. I know. I don't right. listen to me. I am going to lead you astray. I know. I was this. right there at right? 60 bucks, and I was like, dang it. So $65, <laughs> I think that's a great value for this rum. Uh, getting a true natural agricole rum out of Hawaii, American yep. made, which is great. Uh, they do their own sugar cane. They have their own sugar cane farm. They're making yes, their own stuff there. Um, very, very cool company. And I think that the way they're doing this, like they said, five, less than 5% of rums coming out are agricoles. It's a dinosaur, guys. It's coming back it's from coming extinction, back. Yes. which is great and great to see. Companies know, like this I, doing that. I know. It's the companies like this paving the way for that, and I think that is truly amazing. If you're looking for a really, really great cocktail mixer, trying some new rums, expressing out, looking for that next thing, or you love agricoles, this is this is it. This yeah. is the one. We found it. Yeah, and if you can't find it in your liquor store, you can talk to your liquor store and say, hey, get a case of this in. 
I want to try this. Yeah. Or better yet, you could actually go to KulianaRum.com. Figure and out where you can get it. Yep. Got to send them an email. Send them an email. Send them a pigeon. <laughs> send it off. Tie a note to its leg and send it to Hawaii. I don't know if the bird's gonna make it. Uh, I it's don't a long, think so. It's a long, yeah. Might need a bigger bird. Bigger bird. Yeah, we're gonna need a bigger bird. Yeah, bigger bird. <laughs> Maybe a seagull. I don't know. Something Flash that can sit on a cruise ship out there. Flashback of the jaws. We're gonna need a bigger boat. We're gonna, we're gonna need, <laughs> need a, a bigger, bigger boat. boat. <laughs> that is Kuleana Hawaiian Rum Agricole. Make sure you guys check your local liquor stores. Look them up online. Go find yourself a bottle. Don't take our word for it. Go find yourself a bottle and try it for yourself today. Do it. Do it today. If you guys like what we did and you think Roy Air and I need a bigger boat, make sure that you guys subscribe <laughs> to the YouTube channel. Give us a thumbs up. If you love drinking rum, hanging out with other rum lovers, join us here join every us. single week because we're always trying new rums for you guys. We've got the live show as well as our reviews coming out. And make sure you go down there and check out the links down below. Like I said, our rum club, we are trying to fill up that first group there. We're getting it filled up and we're getting uh, rum sent out to people, premium rums, and getting you guys a chance to get some premium rum at your doorstep as well as hang out with some distillers and some other rum lovers. And then on top of that, you guys can check out our Facebook group, our Instagram, our TikTok, and just leave Leave us a comment on what you thought of the show or rum you'd like us to try. We love hearing from you. We do. We love it so much. You guys are the best. You are. Royer, with that, let's get them home safe. Always drink responsibly. Never drink and drive. And no rums were harmed during the making of this video. Not at all. We'll see you next time, guys. Take care. Wow.